So what is going on guys? This is Ryan here and welcome to Dying Light. I'm so hyped, I'm spinning everywhere man. I don't even want to iterate how hyped I am to play this game. It has been something I've wanted to try on the channel for the longest time. Now that we've finished up with Resident Evil, I think it's the perfect opportunity. I don't know how I'm going to do this series. I'll probably end up doing like a multiplayer. Player, hold on. I'm gonna stop myself again right there before I get too into that, but I feel like the best way to explain this is to let Mini 8 Bit Ryan in an aeroplane do the job for me. We figured we'd try this episode in a case that you guys do take off with it. And what we don't hope the series does is this. You see, that's him go. Yeah, that's a crash and burn, okay? Like, you see where I'm going? If you guys do wanna see more of this gameplay, though, definitely leave a like rating down below. If we can get, let's say, 15,000 likes, I'll be back with a part two ASAP. And it'll also show me that you guys definitely do wanna see this as the next gameplay because I don't wanna commit to something that you guys don't enjoy as much as I do. I don't even wanna wait, guys. I wanna get straight into this game. Here we go, guys. This is Dying Light. Oh, man. Data on the subject, Kadir Suleiman. Mm -hmm. A local political figure hired to maintain order after the outbreak. He's obviously not. His brother Hassan right? died in a disease-related incident before we were able to evacuate him. Suleiman blamed the GRE for Hassan's death. He right. stole a highly sensitive file which became his bargaining chip Straight against Dingus the GRE, then, right? with mm. instructions to publicize it if anything happened to him. <gasps> Whoa. On the subject. The stolen file. It details the incomplete process of synthesizing a cure for the virus. <laughs> oh if man! Limited in its current state, the produced substance may be extremely Let's go. toxic. Now. Also, the file contains full description Ooh, of the virion structure. Oh yes. Any attempt to use it oh, results yes. in countless lives lost. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I'm smiling. We're like, we know how bad this talk is, right? Information. Current oh, status. Suleiman sent the file to an associate unknown to us with instructions to publicize it at his command at any time. Oh, wow, Encounter okay. After that, we instituted a citywide communication jam, preventing him from publicizing the file. Ah, uh, this is why we're in. radio can overcome that jamming. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. He's your lifeline. Do not lose it. Suleiman has since gone underground and begun using a different name. We have reason to believe he now leads one of the two main factions operating within the city. Oh, dang. You are to find Suleiman and locate the stolen file. So, so good. In order to save mankind so, so good. from a disaster of unprecedented proportions. I feel ya, I feel ya. We know what we gotta do. Whoa, this game looks nuts. It's like a three-year-old game too. And is this dude ever parachute before? Like, that's coming down hard, right? Oh, we're good. We're good. Oh, no, we're strangling. Looks dead. Come on, man. Release the shoe. And busted up legs. Okay. No, we're good. We're good. Not yet. Not I yet. Told you that wasn't a normal drop shoot. Where the frick? Legs. What? Then take him to rise. Well, thanks, guys. Welcome. All of you. Huh? Stop. Here's my welcome. Loud noises draw them. Maybe that's a good thing then. <laughs> Dingus, I'm gonna shoot my gun straight in your forehead. Right. I'm not gonna get no chance. Come on. Come on. There you go. There you go. That's what we do. Pop them. Pop them. They're Fall clearly back. thugs. Like Fall right. Back. Oh my gosh. This ain't good. Oh. We're like blurry so Oh my god, okay, I'm- Whoa! Whoa! Wait, what? I'm already bit? No way. Oh, who the freak is this? Okay. Looks like the dude just took his jacket off and he's the bad guy. Oh no, they're good. They're good. We gotta move. Go. Oh. Oh my god! That just looks crazy. No way. If the gameplay is like this, like, I'm sold so much. Right. Holy... No way. No. Is he good? Come on, man. Come on. No. What? Wow, man. What the freak is going on here? This is crazy. I gotta take my glasses off for this, guys. This is nuts. Right? What is happening? Oh, don't black out again, dude. Oh, dang. Tower, this uh, is you got the jammer as well? Like, you, you know, can't communicate? Got a guy Probably with a bad head wound and the bite on one arm. Yeah, we're, we're done. Like, what? Amir's hurt? No. Amir is gone. He's gone, man. But I'm bringing in someone who might still survive. So that was Amir. We'll right, see. Now, dude. And we're gone. Oh. My goodness. Welcome to what was this place called again? Thanks, Tower Screen. City of Haran. Welcome to Haran, guys. You're scared. What? I'm not scared. Then pinch him. You've been bit, though. He blinked. Right? What? He blinked again. Did we? What if he's a zombie? Did we? I can't see nothing. Oh, yeah, we are. Hi, right, kids. Run! Calm down. Whoa. 
This game looks so insane. Like, if this is cutscene graphics, I get it. Or is this actual game graphics, man? Whoa. We're like fogging out. Our vision is going insane. Okay. This is game. Are you kidding me right now? Look at this. This view looks so beautiful. I don't think this game's about to make me cry. <laughs> All right, enough of that. So the kids ran this way. So we're going to go on through. How's it going, friendos? Uh, hello? I swear I just saw some kids here behind this door here. So F to open. Let's go. Hello? We're good. You sleep for I think. Three days, like a dead man that scared children. Off to a great three days. Start, Where am I? Thanks, Rock. All right. Okay. Enough joking around. Head to room 190. 190. The boss will brief you. All right, uh, bro. What do you mean 31? Like, That's the me? boss. He's acting like I should know everything. Like, are you kidding? Just enabled subtitles as well for you guys, so you can actually see. So room. 31. That's your number. I'm 31. What are you? Uh, Selma. Excuse me. Your number. You're the 31st infected. Oh. I'm the 18th. Hello, 18. Everything is counted here. All right. One fewer doses of antizin. One more new infected. Dang. One more runner gone. All right. Well, well thanks for making me feel bad for, like, getting bit. You will die what? because of this guy? Quiet. Guys, you understand that you're... Quiet. Now he's gonna get a meal yeah, yeah, keep whispering, boss. I'm right in your face. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. You're not talking now. And you, Sick, mate. you are... Crane. Uh, 31. 31. His oh, voice is epic, right. dude. Um, how's your head? My head? What? Got it. Listen up. I? What? Until the boss says so, you are not on the list. So go talk to him ASAP and let's get things moving. Now, if you'll excuse me. All right. Take care. Go see the boss in room 190. So we got to go upstairs. And I'm going to assume that this place is like a safety central hub. Kind of feels like it. And I'm also getting some vibes of almost like alien isolation with the graphics and where the game is playing. I'm looking for the boss. So is he in there? Oh. You're 31. Mm -hmm. Go on in. More genuine person. Thank goodness for that. It's not my fault I got bit after all, you know? I've actually come here to save you guys, or I think anyway. Hello? Hello, hello? Uh, is this the boss man? Like, or, or the boss child? Like, he looks about 16. Like, even from the back, I can tell he's young. If I'm right, I'm literally freaking like Sherlock Holmes. Yeah, I'm looking for the... Yeah, I'm Sherlock the Holmes, boss? right? You can call me freaking Sherlock from now on. What, am I too young? You got the problem with my age? I'm down. No, I... You wanted to talk to me? That's better. Do you remember anything? Know what you are? Yeah, I can, I can see this is some kind of shelter. Mm -hmm. We call it the tower. Brecken and his runners put it all together a couple of months ago, and we've been here ever since, hunting airdrops, scavenging, and rescuing people. Yeah, I, I wanted to thank that girl. Good, because if not for her, you'd already be chewing somebody's knee bone. Very precise, Your right? Your was totally crushed so what, is, that, is that step one of zombies, straight for the knee bone, and second for the forehead, you know? Radio. Oh, great. So can I get that back, please? Actually, I think I need it more than you do. This dude. Believe me, pal, that's not the case. Has no idea. Fine, take it. Well, there you go. That's one way to get something you know back. You know runners put their lives in danger for guys like you. Hold the freak up! I haven't even done so anything yet. Like, give me a sec. Else, and you won't even share your gear with us. Oh wow! Good I don't have time to deal with your bullshit. Okay. I lost contact with one of our guys thanks to the f***ed up radios we're stuck with. Do something for me, would you? Mm -hmm. I don't want to see you or your precious radio anymore. So go be useful somewhere else. All right, freaking we moody. Don't tolerate lazy you know? assholes here in the tower. Wow, as, as he ironically sits down. I'm not lazy, I'm just... Hey, boss. Save it. That last guy I mentioned, he's only on the 13th floor. But he might as well be trapped in a mine cave -in. Come back later. Okay. And I'm not the boss. Oh. Too young, remember? I'm Rahim. Brecken's in charge here. So wait, you, you like, you had a go at us for like, assuming the right thing? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, we was right. This place, I'm not getting on with these people so far, guys. So what, what you got cooking up in here, huh? Mini ravioli, that's quite a big ravioli though, I'm just saying. All right, these dudes eating like trash. I, I guess that's better than eating uh, flesh, you know? You little sh Tell how we had to walk out to say that. So check for the lost survivor on the 13th floor. You know something interesting, guys? Most buildings like this don't actually have a 13th floor, I don't think. Like, most hotels you go to, they never have that floor 13. Seems like most know about the spooky things that happen on floor 13. So wait, how do we get downstairs? Uh, sick bay. There's like, I've run a circle right now, but I need to get down to floor 13. There's gotta be uh, an elevator somewhere. Hmm, I can hear sound coming from behind one of these two doors. Oh no, it's just the radio there. Okay, that probably makes more sense. All right, let's check out floor 19. Ah. Yeah, now this looks like some kind of safety measurement that's been put in place. I see you looking at me as well, all right? Like, I'm trying, guys. I'm just being judged too quickly. Can we talk to this guy, maybe? Where do you think you're going? Floor 13. 13th floor. I'm getting some stuff for Raheem. 13? Shit. It's gonna be some dirty work. But we all got to pull our weight around here, huh? I guess so. Let's uh, see if we can do this then, man. Here we go. Floor 13. Let's do this. So what is floor 13? Oh, Jesus. My. 
How many people died here? Just one! Just a big one! Okay. <laughs> no, please, no. No. Okay, thank gosh for that. Oh. Hey, oh, that's busted, dude. We shouldn't answer. Look at this place. It's crazy. Crane here. Where were you? Whisper. We've been waiting for your report. It's been over 70 hours. I lost my radio for a while. Don't worry. My cover's intact. No contact with the tower's leader yet. Unable to confirm identity. So blue. Taking steps to blend in. Acknowledged. Time is of the essence, Crane. Remember that. Got it. There's, there's one more thing. I... I got bitten. I've shown no symptoms, but the people here say I'm infected. Yep. Then you'd better get your hands on some antisem ASAP. No! Help! Help! Somebody! What the hell? Gotta turn that radio off. She hears. All right, what do I have right there? That's some kind of pipe. We'll do the job. So, press shift to sprint. Let's go. Now we can start running. Let's go. So, help. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to do this quietly, guys. Push this. Oh my god. Oh, okay. Let's hit this dude. Ah, straight in the freaking dingle roof. Ah! <laughs> Stealing Umperville's terms right there. Oh. That sounds like a flannel being squeezed out. You know when the water's in there and you like drain it, you know? I Cut my arm, okay. getting away from him. Okay. Oh God, you had to kill him, didn't you? Uh huh. <laughs> God damn it! Oh man, that was that was my brother. I came down to see him and. That's gotta be easy. Hard. Easy. It's all right now. I'll, I'll get help. Oh wow. Hey, Raheem, this is Crane. Did I do down good? here on thirteen. Really? Listen, this guy of yours got fucked up pretty bad getting away from a zombie. Who's this? Like, I really don't want him to see 31? this. You went after Mark. Is it safe down there? I don't know, is it? Yeah, it's safe enough now. Oh, okay, man. don't move. I'm sending Lena downstairs. Can we, like, have some respect, close the door, move the body, or are we literally gonna let this dude stare at what was his brother like? I'm sorry, man, all right? I'm sorry. This game is crazy, dude. All right, we have uh, some kind of crate right here. Can we open this? I guess we... Ooh. Ooh, my goodness me. Okay, that's crazy. Let's get away. So we got that done. Where do we go from here on out? We have to go back up. Maybe round towards the elevator. Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna check the other side, man. Another place just here. Oh, yeah, this place has seen- Oh my gosh. I think every place down here has seen better days. Can I just hear? Wait, 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 hold up. There's something in there. Maybe that's for the best. Maybe that right there is for the best. Well, your brother's gone, so, um, I mean, I popped his head, but I, I guess your brother's okay. Maybe he didn't die? Hold still. Lena will be here any minute. Mm -hmm. Gosh. You've got to find some gauze. Oh, and alcohol. Okay, Combine would... them. That will stop the bleeding. <laughs> Please hurry. I, I try to stay you, calm, okay? I'll be right back. Let's do this. We've got to find some gauze and alcohol. Now we can open these. So there's some metal parts. Oh, dude. Is this going to be like Subnautica, but zombies? Like how you can uh, craft and make stuff as you go? If so, that's so cool. That is literally alien isolation and Subnautica combined. Still need that gauze. Uh, what was with that base boom right there? Uh, there's some duct tape. I'll take that. Dude, is something else down here with me? Let me check over here one more time. Maybe we can open this now. No, we still can't open that. There's a zombie behind there, though. In a fridge, maybe they store the alcohol in there. Yes, they do. Good call. There's some nails. We'll definitely be taking that. Could be anywhere around here, though. Okay. Let me check this door. Oh. Ooh. Bruh. Okay. Bloody footprints going that way. Guys, okay, hold on. Let me just... Okay, I thought somebody just, like, came in my house right there. I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. Okay, I got the sound way too loud. An aid kit. There's your gauze. Okay, I think There's that's everything I'm gonna find. Should Let's I give this a shot. How do we craft it? Maybe tab, is it? I to enter the blueprints menu. So blueprints in the top corner, uh, a med kit, gauze in the alcohol, and then we simply press create on that. That's how we craft. Very simple. And we got a little craftsman achievement. I've put away my uh, pipe. I don't know how to uh, equip the thing or anything. I'm pressing E, all the buttons. Uh, maybe we're okay though. Maybe we don't necessarily need to. Some electronics. That was an old phone right there. Let's check inside here. Oh. Okay, okay, I see you, I see you. Let's get the gauze back over to this guy anyway. We don't want to skip this. I'm gonna apply it to the wound. You're gonna have to move your hand. Ooh, he got you good, didn't he? Yeah, he really- Okay, who's hurt? Oh He's bleeding God. pretty bad. Let me see him. Gauze and alcohol, huh? Mm -hmm. Pretty primitive, but it'll work. Did our best. You got some dirty hands, man. Should you really be treating him? Like, you know? Thanks for the help. I'll take care of him from here. Thank you very much for honoring the fact that I actually did some help, all right? Maybe this is then how we start to earn our keep. Oh, there's the dude. All right, 250. You got anything well smart to see? Thank you very much. <laughs> now we're getting the respect we deserve around here, man. Not bad for a new guy. Uh-huh. Perhaps I misjudged you. Oh, you did. May I just want to help out and repay you guys for what you did for me. Mm -hmm. Well, good. Come find me. 
and we'll talk about how you can do that. Okay, I can kind of see then that maybe that dude that was upstairs, he was putting on the strong front, he was young. Maybe he's trying to give that impression to us, but in fact, he's like a kind-hearted guy deep down. Let's, uh, let's go find out anyway. I like the fact that we can run, and especially how fast you feel like you're moving when you're doing so. Really cool, man. So, back into headquarters. Here we go. Oh, is that the boss? All right, taking care is that of the boss, Daddy. Piece of cake. Huh? Huh? What else you got for me? The same, I guess. Well, let me think. Rahim, you're again. just smart enough to be dangerous. You know that? Omar told me about your plans for the nest. Explosive charges? Really? What? Explosives? Oh, are we just here, that? like? You can't tell a convincing lie to save your I'm life. Looking over there, like you, you know, know what I'm doing? Yeah? You think you can't die? You're not my mom. No, I'm not. Our mom's dead. So you so might okay, want to be a little sister. nicer to me since I'm the only family you have left. Especially now that Amir is gone. You're Dang. Jade, right? Right. I just wanted to thank you for what you did for me and, and tell you how sorry I am for your loss. I owe you and Amir my life. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you do. You want to return the favor? Keep my dipshit brother from killing himself. That's gonna be hard. I'm telling you right now. No explosives, Rahim. Okay. You know, he's too young, you know. You can already kind of tell. So, uh, all right, we still gotta be in here, though. We gotta talk, I think, to Rahim. So, so, is that enough? Do I get to talk to Brecken now? I'm so angry. First, go change your clothes. I left some new ones for you in your room. You're in 194. Thank you. Something wrong with what I'm wearing? You need something that fits the job Brecken wants you to do. Oh, okay. Call me when you've changed. We're gonna be a runner, guys. That's what I think anyway. Talk to Raheem. Now we're gonna go get dressed into our new clothes. Change into your little look, runner clothes. One, nine, four. I mean, I'm happy these guys have just literally given me a free place to crash, you know? God. Okay, so we go into run 194. Uh, whereabouts do we find these runner clothes? Maybe just over here. Let's get changed then into our running gear. Fresh clothes, as it were. Okay, Raheem, I'm mm -hmm. ready. Where do I find Brecken? Not so fast, 31. Wow. If you're going to earn your keep, we have to find out if you've got the skills. All right. So get your ass up to the gym. Uh, gym? Are you kidding me? It's on the top floor. Okay. Just a couple flights up. Okay. This was like, was it covered before? Yeah, look, now we can keep walking up. Okay. I love how there's so much life in this place. You know, everyone seems to be doing something. It feels so... I want alive! Like, you know? How else do I wear this? Raheem, I don't see you. Where are you? Well, you're only looking in a straight line. Dude, what, what the freak? What, what do you want me to do? Oh my god. Really? Okay, now you've busted the place down. That's not very smart, Raheem, is it? Well, First explosives, now this. For? Let's go. <gasps> yes! This is so cool. Press and hold space to jump and grab the ledge you're looking at. I got ya! Marked with the yellow for now. <laughs> we're gonna have this once we're actually running around, though. Then he wants to- right oh, What's this thing? Alright. Wow. You're, you're really funny, Raheem. You hear all that laughter. We're a natural, guys. All right. Oh, nay, look at this. Running across this. Close my eyes! Oh, I probably shouldn't, though. <laughs> okay, let's just get down this. And there he is right there. So, question number two, who the freak was controlling the crane? Or are you just like super quick, you know? Welcome to our gym. First things first, you've got to learn how to run. All right, got it. What do you mean, learn how to run? Just do what I say, all right? Now, jump down to the very bottom. Wait, what? Are you kidding me? Are you out of your you mind? I'd kill myself. Don't be a wimp. No. Are you serious right now? Come on, you can't be serious. We've been here like Watch 10 this. minutes. No. Ah, Raheem! My leg! Don't move! I'll get help! Ha. I was just f***ing with you. That's Son really funny, what? man. You can't take a joke? Come on! Get your ass down here! No Christ, way. way. Crutch. I think it'd be more, like, maybe two crutches. Alright, guys, I've been to, like, trampoline in places. You know when you look over, like, a 10 foot edge and you got to jump? I can barely do that. And we got our character doing this oh, jump! Oh, oh shit. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> rush, wow. <laughs> but don't blow your load just yet. Mm. There's more. To Great. survive outside, you got to take advantage of the terrain. All Most right. eaters suck at climbing. So the harder the terrain is, the better for you. All right. I've got some typical situations set up for you. Let's see how you handle them. Let's do it. Typical situations, he says. All right, you know what? I'm actually run this. Oh, yeah. I feel that music coming in right now, so see to Doug. Okay. See to Doug. All right, I'm trying to position my fingers in such a way then. Big arrow pointing through here. Straight up the stairs. Now we've probably got a running jump over here. Called it already. This way? Maybe? Like, I'm guessing. Dude, I ain't running. I ain't slowing down. Uh, oh my god. Are you kidding me? Slow down? Like, I'm about to jump like a 500 ledge. Should I say 500 foot ledge? Let's go! Not bad. Dang, dude. For a noob. Run and jump up there. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, this feels right. so invigorating, man. Let's go. Don't fall, because okay. there sure as hell ain't no net. 
I, uh, I, yeah, so I can see. Jump down here. We want to walk just across here. Nice and easy stuff. Oh, so up here. Freaking, are you kidding me? A muscle up, dude? How strong are we? Like, how does he know we're this strong, you know? Like, muscle ups take everything. Look at another ledge and press space to jump towards it. Yes, let's go. Like it. Really like it. Same thing here. Look at the ledge, jump and grab. Nice. Oh, man, these running mechanics are super cool. Good job. Okay, so where do we go now? Okay. Can I jump down? Time for the real let's jump into here. Nice. Instant crash. Make use of okay. anything and everything while you run. All right, here's where we get to practice then everything that we've just learned. Let's do this. Okay, a little bit more. Then we can probably look behind, jump on that thing. And if we cut our fingers already, jump onto here. Yep. I see. Back to the crane, he said. Crane to the crane. <laughs> so funny, guys, because my name's Crane. <laughs> All right, let's get over here. Okay, so I think we're here. Nice. Name up. Whoa, did you see that? Maybe that might blow our cover, I guess. The closest I ever came to this was running track in high school. All right. Oh, yeah, the cracks are going to emerge in our actual like, job, I guess. Plus 500, just like that. So, talk to Raheem. Where the heck is he? Maybe he's back here, you know? Maybe he already made his way back. So, let's jump up here and let's run, man. What? I mean... What is happening to me? Oh, don't shit. fall. Don't fall. Oh, shit. Talk it's to me. What's going on? I don't even know. Something went wrong. Oh, don't fall. Raheem. Don't fall. What just happened to me? Don't fall. Oh, shit. I bet you're having your first seizure. Your seizure? Just get back over here. I tried to, man. But like, come on, I'm nearly dying right now. Made it back across. So we're having seizures right now? Are you kidding me? Ask Raheem about the seizure? Okay, here he is. I see you right now. All right, I'm right in front of you. Hello? There we go. What the f*** was that? Wow. Does this mean I'm, I'm turning? Kinda. Most Maybe. likely, no. At least not yet. Seizures reminds you that you're infected. You better go see Dr. Zera, though. He'll check you out. Probably give you a shot of antizen. Before you head out to see Zera... Talk to the quartermaster. He'll uh, gear you up so you can go outside without getting your head bitten off. Reassuring. I want to keep my forehead, you know? Now we're going to go back downstairs. I think it was floor 18. Was that where we had, like, the medicine stuff? There's the bedroom. Headquarters. Maybe it was this one here. This is the sick bay. I kind of suppose this is where I should go. Oh, wait, no. Hold up. We got to go down to the elevator floor. Okay, that's floor 18. So I think it was one floor higher for the elevator. Yeah, it's going to have to be. Here we go. Just around this corner. Whoa. I thought we was turning on something right there. Hold F to ride the elevator all the way down. Let's go. All right. They've given me go. an actual job. Mm. And nobody suspects I'm not who I say I am. So far, so good. It's like a prologue or something. And once Dr. Zara helps me manage these symptoms I'm dealing with, I'll be even better. Ah. Okay. Got it. So let's go downstairs. Let's find out what we got to do then. So talk to the quartermaster. Whereabouts? No smoking flammable materials. Who is this guy? Can we talk to him? Uh, hey. How's it going? That's outside the first look. And outside since the beginning anyway. All right, here we go. This oh, is the quartermaster. you're the new scout. We are. Rahim radioed me about you. That's good, yeah, right? That's me. Name's Crane. <laughs> All right. I'm not going to bother learning your name till you survive a few days. But here, Point? this is for you. It's painful, you know? By the oh, way, I thought I was gonna give word this to around the tower is you're just another deadbeat in line for food or antizen. Are you kidding me By right now? By which I mean the people here don't much like you. But don't blame them. It's easy to get paranoid when you're isolated. Mm -hmm. And since somebody's jamming communications to the outside, there's plenty of paranoia to go around. Fantastic. Whole damn city with nobody to call for help but ourselves. You bring me some supplies from the airdrops, though, and you'll see people change their tunes in a hurry. That's a game changer. For fall breaking. If you're looking to get more popular, you can try helping folks. Oh, heck yeah. Do a few favors. Mm. They might like you more. Side objectives, let's go, oh, man. Keep you warm at night. <laughs> Rusty adjustable wrench. The quartermaster will provide you with free items each day. Oh my goodness, make sure you visit him. Like, you got it. And we're going to go back. Thank you very much. I mean, can we take this? A table lock. I mean, it sounds painful, right? All right, man, I'm going to hop down. I sure hope this is the right thing to do. Kind of feels like it, you know? Here we go. Going outside, right, yeah. Apparently... Let's go with the first look at him. Okay, new guy. Be careful out there. Okay. We've lost too many already. Got it, man. Is he UK? Sounds kind of British, you know? Oh! I can't see! I can't see! It's so bright! Now my eyes have adjusted. Dude, look how cool this game looks! Okay, noob. We saw Dr. Zera set up in a semi-trailer on a fenced and plain court. Dude, this is so when you leave the tower, hang a left and head due south. You can't miss it. Alright, I got crane, it. It's kid. All right, all right, crane. <laughs> Just keep moving. 
All right, got it. To take in the sight. Oh, dude. Oh my god. And try not to make too much noise. Uh huh. Sound attracts those fuckers. Oh, I got it, man. Goodness. We are out here now, guys. This is it. This is where the free roam side comes in, and we're just doing this. I'm turning my sound up. Three guys just down there. All right, so much noise. Let me try and jump over here. Maybe we can find some resources just inside, because I don't want to give anything a miss. Hmm, not looking like anything's in here. Are you guys ready? I kind of think I am. I guess I got no choice. All right, alleyway looks fairly quiet. Let's go. Jump down. There's one. There's two. We are near enough on the ground level, guys. All right, I see this. Okay, that is some batteries. That'll be useful in anything requiring, like, an electric current, I would imagine. Another one in here. I wonder if those guys are sensitive to light. So I feel like I'm gonna have to be careful. So we got some string. So get a shot of Anton from Dr. Zero. You know what? I should probably focus on living rather than picking up batteries. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay. That's about 20 zombies right there. I am just gonna go this way, all right? Does that mean they see you? Or is that just like a normal sound, you know? Okay, let's just keep going. Let's go up here. I feel like as time goes on, I'll be able to really like sprint around this town too. I'm looking forward to that. Here we go then. So, uh, oh, what the heck was that? Oh, hold up. Here. Just here, I see. So, let me hop down. Ouch. Legs broke. Noise draws the attention of dangerous virals. Beware. Uh, there's gotta be a way we can get in here. Can't talk to this guy. Can we? Hold up. Nope. Like, this dude isn't even freaking acknowledging me. Wow. He's gonna run around the edge. Gotta be a door. Or maybe like a crack in some of this, like, fence work, you know? I love how these guys are just sharpening their blades whilst I'm there running around. They're really trying to get help. They don't care. Maybe we can get on this ledge here. And then we jump over. Okay, this is good. Let's go. One, two, three. <laughs> Broken our legs again. Just inside here, then. Let's go. There's the thud, and again, Doctor, oh, or not. Hello, anybody there? Camden, Whoa. are you there? It's not Camden. Uh, so, I'm supposed to get a vaccine? What? I said no, doc. no, suppressant. It's called antizen. So it doesn't Suppresses actually... the symptoms. Here, sit. Haha. <laughs> antizen postpones the inevitable. <laughs> oh, wow. Best the GRE could do. Hopefully they can cure it then. Inevitable? So, th there's no cure? It's a variation of rabies. Oh. There's no cure right now, but you see, I've been running tests on both antizen and infected tissue. A cure is possible. Definitely possible. Oh, shit. You really think you can figure it out? Hmm. With Dr. Camden's help, yes. I think so. Uh, now, where did I put that injector? What? We got it. <laughs> he gave it to Who's us. Dr. Camden? Uh, is this the right doctor to be treating us, you know? Zero, where the outbreak first, well, broke out. We've been collaborating via radio. That's the shot. Though we would have made more progress if the connection were better. Maybe we can help. Also, if my earlier experiments had borne fruit, I tried injecting recombined versions of the virus into chunks of meat and leaving them around the city, mm -hmm. hoping some of the infected would eat them ah. so I could observe and document the results anything good from but that they didn't bore no fruit wow man i'm ashamed that i wasted so much time on it no reason to hold any antizen in reserve now in any case all right i'm quite busy so on your way now well thanks doc what was i doing doc, seriously this guy's working on the cure like he's probably forgot that he's already done it raheem zara checked me out and gave me another shot he did okay great not out to hold you for a while Okay. Which is good, because I'm starting to get used to the idea of bossing you around. Oh, oh my god, so, I need to be careful. time for a real trial. All right. Go talk to Spike. You'll find him near Zeta's truck. He's got the first real job for you. All right, got it. First assignment, get a job from Spike, okay? So, I, I don't know how to draw my weapons, guys. It's not the most important thing. Okay, I'm gonna hop down. Maybe it'll draw... Oh, it draws your weapon. I think uh, I'm probably gonna finish up this first episode here, but I at least want to try and kill some of these Zeds, you know? Like, check this out. <laughs> and one more time. All right, I didn't realize that, uh, you know, there was about 50 of you guys, so uh, I'll finish this one up. And it's just... This weapon is trash, okay? Oh, God, that guy's... Oh, my God, that guy's running. Oh, okay, at least I got a barrier now. Oh, What? Oh my goodness, he landed straight on the spikes. Uh, I, I can actually search it from there. Okay, this might be dangerous. Yeah, I got punched in the face by that one. Oh, I see you slipping around right there. I see you slipping around. Sit on the floor. Sit the freak down, huh? Sit down. Search that body. You got $16. You earn currency from killing these guys. Thankfully, they're very slow. But that's interesting. I can kind of see where this could go in that case. Can you, like, smash the heads easier if you're actually looking at it? Like, right there. Weapon is broken. Use tank. God, this weapon is freaking trash, dude. Like, freaking trash. And they're ready? Still not done? Oh my god, it says weapon is broken, but we're still hitting this person, you know? I'm gonna have to stand on this lamppost top here, guys. Oh, shoot. This is bad, isn't it? I got this pipe here. That does the job. Let's get rid of this one here. Arr, and again. Arr. Oh! 
Can I do that again? Okay, do a downward strike, Crane. Let's go. Oh my god, that guy ran. You know what? No, no, no. This ain't good. This ain't good. I'm gonna go. Oh man, even in the safest zones. Like, is this zombie seriously putting that washing up to dry? Like, I'm sorry I'm getting your blood all on this. Okay, don't swing at me like that. All right, I'll swing Weapon ineffective. Hold up, hold R to repair weapon. Maybe we're using like the scrap and stuff that we got. So, ah, I understand. Slowly starting to understand this now, guys. Got some cigarettes from this zombie again. Like, these guys are smoking. In here, we got alcohol. We know we can make a gauze and halva. Uh, you've picked up uh, an unspent. That was like a med kit of some kind. Got a lock pick case out here, power cable, and also some metal parts. Right, let's get to what I feel will be a nice safe point at. Uh. All right. Well, there we have it anyway, guys. That is the first episode of Dying Light. I'm really into this so far, and I think I'm going to have to try a second episode regardless. This is 100% my type of game. I know there's, like, mods. There's new game modes. They're actually bringing out new DLC for the story as well every single month. Or it's, like, 10 times this year. They have so much planned for this game, and maybe it'd be a nice time to hop back in because they're keeping the train rolling with this. Also, it seems kind of timeless in terms of, like, the fun you can have. You can kill zombies. You can do, like, free running in between doing the mission stuff. So the possibilities really uh, kind of end. But anyway, guys, if you did enjoy this video, why not drop me that like crane? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I of course hope you did enjoy, and I will of course see you in the next one.